What's up guys, this is Nick Evans with PDCPoker.ag here to go over a little controversial thing that I have with their website and their uh, server, the Merge Network. Um, this is more of a conspiracy in my opinion and I've, I've talked to some people and a lot of people feel the same way about this but um, I mean it's just conspiracy and I just think it's kind of funny how they, uh, it just seems like they're trying to screw you. Anyways. This is a double up. Uh, it's like a dollar. So you pay dollars, ten people, and top five get two dollars. So you double your buy-in. Um, pretty weird structure. Play tighter than normal. Uh, I play tighter than normal. That's my strategy. Um, and once you essentially make double your chips, your starting chips, you're essentially in the clear. I mean, you can still get bubbled, but um, that's very rare. Um, and once you double up, I feel like there's no need to get involved and just let the smaller stacks fight. I have uh, gotten bubbled with pocket aces and ace king and all those great premium hands, so I don't get involved anymore due to um, previous instances. So I get pocket queens, which is great because I have played probably no hands, maybe one or two here and there. You can kind of see on the chart. Uh, queen seven, queen jack, queen two. These are probably all big blonde hands, ace king. It look like big blind hands about the same space. Um, anyways, small blind pocket queens. Um, guy goes all in, pretty standard, and uh, he has a seven. I'm pretty dominant. He has a seven, has the heart draw, and I dodge it. So that's good. He's knocked out, and I have essentially double the buy-in. Well, look what they give you: pocket jacks. And if that's not um, tempting, well, this definitely is. We all post annies, and this short stack to my right raises. Now, if I call this 600, as well as this guy on the left is all in for essentially no chips, like 35 or something. Um, this guy on the right, though, Moby's design, Mosby, Mosby, whatever, he's bet 600. And 600 of my stack, I would still have 2200, but I'm going to have to call off the rest of the stack for sure. There's no doubt that he's going to have to go all in here. It looks like a weak play because he doesn't shove all in, so he could have a weaker hand than me, but this doesn't make me... Um, Invincible. Um, so, as tempting as that may be, I just doubled up, and there's no need for me to get involved. So I fold. Um, he does have pocket queens, and I'm dominated. <coughs> and an ace comes on the flop. Anyways, next hand, pocket threes. Um, starting to see a little trend, maybe. Next hand, pocket fives. And the next hand, pocket sixes. And maybe they started to figure out that I wasn't going to play pocket pair, so they give me the ace-10. Um, it's just really interesting, um, and it's just a kind of a funny conspiracy. I, I don't necessarily care that they're giving me good hands, but I just think it's really funny that uh, you just all of a sudden get all these decent and, or really good and semi-marginal hands back to back to back to back to back. And this happened to me yesterday, and I just thought it would be a really funny video, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, be sure to click thumbs up, and I'll try to find some more funny and peculiar things dealing with poker. Um, and if you like my channel, my other videos, this is probably going to be my first video, but if you like my videos and think I'm a good video guy, <laughs> uh, be sure to subscribe. I really appreciate it. Um, it's been Nick Evans with PDCPoker.ag, and I hope you enjoyed it, and I'm out. Later.